Hey guys, I am back at it for a requested video. This video has been requested by a couple of my friends, Andrea from SPC and then Madison, who I is plans in Wonderland on Instagram, wanted a video of my top like favorite wax. So I'm going with my top 10 favorite waxes of all times. It may not be, some of them is like that specific blend and some of them it's like, I love this scent oil, this is what I have on hand. We're just gonna, we are just going to jump right into it. Um, I'll save my number one favorite for last because I'm sure you guys already know it. Um, I'll start with this one because it's literally empty. I melted it yesterday and I'm gonna order some more when I place my next order from Fantasy Wax. And this is her Sweet Almond, which is almond, cherry, and apples. This is so good. It's literally so strong, no matter, like, it will fill up your entire house. I've gone through maybe three or four of these, obsessed with it, will always repurchase. And then another one from Fantasy that's, I really do enjoy it, but it's more so Christopher's fave. And it is this one from their, like, Disney Christmas collection. And it is Snow on Main Street, Peppermint Candies. I think I have about three or four of these left. We have other peppermint scents, but nothing compares to this one. And we are hoping and praying that it will come back this Christmas season. We will see. But it's really good. It's a very strong, knock you off your feet, nose clearing peppermint. But it is so, 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 so good. And then another one from Fantasy Wax. I, pull, I have like three or four of the scent shot cups. And then they so kindly made me this loaf. Oh my god. And it is in their Reagan's Fave scent. It smells so good. It's like a lemon pound cake. And this scent in particular, this one I do love. But overall, in general, Lemon Bakery, like, has my heart. It is so good. Their wax is just so good. Um, But yeah, highly, highly recommend. Even though I know it's not available right now i would recommend just any lemon pound cake or lemon bakery they're all just wonderful i really only pulled three vendors which it's funny because i said these aren't my specific favorite blends or vendors but the three vendors i picked are also my top three favorite vendors of all time so we have fantasy wax one of my all-time favorites Next, we'll move into L3 Waxy Wonders, which is another favorite of mine there. Probably the most affordable wax for the amount that you get. And yeah, so this next one is a specific blend where this blend, I haven't even, like I have it in multiple things already. And it is, I put a spell on you. Cinnamon sugar, not a spicy cinnamon. French baguettes with our top secret bakery bomb blend. This is not used yet. And it's just so good. I love a cinnamon scent that's not like craft store cinnamon. If you know what I mean, you know what I mean. Like, I don't want it to smell like I'm walking into Michael's or I'm walking into Joanne Fabrics or Hobby Lobby. I want it to smell like a cinnamon, like, roll type of cinnamon. So it does. And you really get the baguettes and it's like, it feels like you're walking into a Cinnabon. It's so good. That's like next to a French bakery. Mmm so good so yummy i love the next this one is just single scent of strawberry pound cake i don't care who it's from i will love it i love strawberry pound cake i think it's phenomenal this one in itself is so good this one's i just got it in and it's already so strong strawberry is our i say our because chris will agree that strawberry is our favorite like fruity scent so good amazing if you see strawberry pound cake from anybody just get it the next one is this i have brought out this loaf from l3 because pumpkin pecan waffles specifically from l3 her oil is like no other it is delicious thick heavy bakery I love everything about it. I don't have it plain, but I have a bunch of different blends with it. And this was the first one I could find. So here we are. And it's just like mm, fall bakery goodness. And for something to like compete with espresso, you know that it's strong. Her pumpkin pecan waffle oil. 
super strong. I have another pumpkin pecan waffle blend from her that um has what's it called strawberry I think pound cake in it and it is also super 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 good I do want to say while filming this I did think of another blend from Elfie Roxy Wonders that I'm obsessed with but I don't have on hand so it's not in this video but if you ever see hot orange danish mixed with any type of coffee just do it I couldn't if I have any I can't find it right now my wax is a mess like always so I do apologize but next I have this one which is three favorite things of mine fresh pa pretzels fresh baked bread and pie crust Pretzel has become one of my favorite scents ever. And I love a good, like, fresh baked bread scent. So, with that being said, have not melted this one yet, but those notes in itself are a favorite of mine. So, I wanted to include this as well. And then the last vendor, which is my other, these are, like I said, like top three, no particular order, but it's Birdie's Making Scents. And with this, you guys will see my favorite scent oil of all time, zucchini bread, okay? It's not in this first one, but it's in the other two. This is my favorite coffee blend of all time. And I love coffee scents. I hate coffee, but I love coffee scents. And this one is Cafe Vienna, which is bold coffee infused with vanilla, caramel, and brown sugar. And it's such like a sweet coffee, like... We have this one coffee shop at the mall where, like, the whole section of the mall smells like it. Like, you smell, like, that vanilla creamer and the caramel. And the, you just, ugh, it's making my mouth water. So good. And then I have this one, which I have, have like, four or five of on hand. And it is zucchini pumpkin bread from Birdie's. You guys already know, zucchini is a top scent of mine. I'm going to pull this out. Her wax is incredibly soft. But this literally, if you put this on a plate, somebody would think it was a slice of bread. And it's just, oh, it's so good. It's not seasonally appropriate right now because I am a seasonal melter. But it literally smells like pumpkin bread. Mmm, it's just like fall. So good. This was, I think, like the first scent I ever actually melted from Birdie's. And that's what made me fall in love with her. And okay, guys, drum roll, please. I'm gonna show you my favorite scent of all time. And I'm not gonna lie when I say I think I have about 10 of them right now on hand. And yeah, I will every, she told me she'll always restock it for me. So I will always buy it. And it is Make Up Your Mind from Birdie's Making Sense. Strawberry White Cake Zucchini Bread. I have tried to like dupe this from different shop vendors, like with customs, nothing comes close, nothing compares. She works literal magic. I have a bunch of them in this shape, which is like a slice of white cake with strawberry frosting. I have a couple of croissants in this scent. And then I have, mm, it just smells so good. A couple of like mini cakes, which it's like half the size of this and it's like two little ones. Mm, 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 mm. And then she's coming out with a loaf soon and I pray to God I'm able to snag one of those. But this is phenomenal. I've turned all of my friends on to it. Anybody I've had try it, nobody has not liked it. So, like, everything else is tied for second, but this is first. Like, is what it is. But, yeah, this is probably a pretty quick video, but you guys have been wanting it, so I wanted to provide the content for the people, okay? So, if you've tried any of these scents, let me know. Did I turn you on to this scent? I have to know. I have to know how many people are on my train of this being amazing. So if you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. Or if you didn't, give it a thumbs down. Either way, you're helping my channel. So do me a favor. Subscribe if you haven't already. Comment down below. And I will see you next time. Bye, guys.